Hello everybody, what is up? My name is Shinosaur, and today we are doing an Assassin's Creed Unity giveaway for the PC. Full disclosure, this code is good for the PC. It, it is not an Xbox 360, Xbox One, PS3, or 4. This is a PC code. Please check the description down below for the PC requirements. You need a good graphics card to run this game. The main reason why I'm giving this game away is because the minimum requirements for Assassin's Creed Unity is for the GTX 680. Now I have the 660. You can see where the problem is. I can't run this game. If you were not aware, I went to an event called Game 24. It's when NVIDIA announced the new 900 series graphic cards. At the presentation, they're handing out games away. Like, I already have Far Cry 4. That's already been redeemed. I have a series for this. The crew, I already redeemed this. Assassin's Creed Unity was the game I was keeping. I have not used the code yet, so this code is still good. This is what I'm giving away. So, as you can see, we have a lot of Assassin's Creed stuff. Yeah, have you guys heard of Assassin's Creed before? I heard it was kind of a big game. And I might have went overboard on the collector editions. Before we actually do the giveaway, I'm going to show you some of the stuff I've been collecting over the years. So might as well. I'm a huge Assassin's Creed nerd, so we'll have fun together. Yeah, the Assassin's Creed Black Fight Strategy Guide. Yeah, this is one nice-ass book. It is super detailed. It teaches you about the game, where all the hidden stuff is at. It's a really good strategy guide. I used the crap out of this book when Assassin's Creed Black Flight came out last year. It is really handy to have, and I'm glad I bought it. It was only like 35 bucks. Comes with a nice cover of Kenway. It's kind of like a sleeve, like a book sleeve. So here's the front of the strategy guide. That is one nice ship you got there. And over here we have... Look at my light! That is so freaky! Halloween's over! Stop it, ghost! Ah, oh, go away! And right here we have Assassin's Creed 3. This is with Connor! When the revolution kicked in, such a great game. I loved it. I just didn't like the multiplayer. Uh, believe it or not, I was not a huge fan of the multiplayer. I love the single player. Ubisoft knows what they're doing with single player, but multiplayer, it just didn't feel like it. Because when you're in single player, you feel like a god. But when you're multiplayer, you kind of feel vulnerable. It's really hard to kill people. Well, the way they reward you is you have to assassinate people, like hiding in the hay. You have to get a lot of stealth kills. And the stealth kills are about two or 300 points, and average kills like 50 or 100. So, yeah, I wasn't a big fan of the multiplayer. Over here, we have George Washington's notebook. And bad thing about this thing, um, look what happened to my notebook. I should have returned this. came in the limited edition for Assassin's Creed 3. And look at the fucking uh, pages. They're all ripped and torn apart. That's how I got this book. GameStop was doing returns, and I didn't know about it until it was too late. So, yeah, my book's kind of fucked up. They're so torn apart. That is bad. Look at that. It's worse than my pants. God damn, this notebook's torn apart. It's a really neat notebook. I read through it. And then over here is the limited edition Black Flag case. It's actually a steel case. The game's in here. Well, the game's actually in my console. I play it on Xbox One. This is just a soundtrack, and that's a bunch of uh, paperwork I should not show on camera because there's a bunch of redeem codes on there. All right, so let's put this away. What else do we have in my collection? Ah, oh, who do we have here? Oh, this guy looks familiar. Hi there, Ezio. Well, this is actually the old Ezio. This is from Revelations. Here's Ezio, the legendary assassin. This is from Assassin's Creed Revelations. I bought this at the GameStop Expo. It's a really neat bobblehead. Look, I am Ezio. Hear me roar. Ha 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 ha. I, I should have stopped. I can't do voices. It's a really neat statue of Ezio. He has like the hidden blades right there so you can see them. Hello, iPod. Who was that? Oh, it's Nate. Hello, Nate. You're on YouTube. Say hello, Nate. My iPod's been blowing up. As soon as I mentioned I was doing an Assassin's Creed giveaway, yeah, people went kind of hectic. I have like 20,000 retweets on my picture I posted a couple hours ago. All right, well, hello, Connor. How you doing? This is the limited edition statue from Assassin's Creed 3. You have the famous tomahawk. Oh, yeah, look at that tomahawk. I love the tomahawk, dude. That was so badass. You have Connor's sword. Let me zoom in. Oh, there's a sword. You have his little hidden blade. Where is it? There it is. A little hidden blade. Can you look at his face? Connor, you in there? Oh, oh no, they blocked Connor's face off. Aw. And then you have the American flag. Well, this is actually the old school flag. This is the 13 colony flag. Right now, the United States flag has 50 stars. Here it has 13. Every colony had a star. It's 13 on here. Connor also has a bow and arrow right there. See, right on his back. So it's a real nice statue. I loved it. 140 bucks for that collection edition. It was not bad. I, I don't regret buying it. I fucking love the statue. I'm a huge Assassin's Creed nerd. So what else do we have? <gasps> we have the pirate chest. Hey, you guys want to see what's in the pirate chest? Let's look in there. Dum 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 Hello, chest. What can possibly be in this chest? <gasps> it's opening. Oh, what is it? Oh, it's a flag. Oh, this flag up there. This is the Assassin's Creed black flag. I got in my collector edition. And over here is the Assassin's Creed flag. See, like the 13 colonies are up there. It kind of looks like the same one. This is actually life size. Like this, that's how big the flag is. 
It has an assassin logo in there. And the chest I just opened, it's a cloth version. This thing is huge. Let me roll it out. This is how big the flag is. It's basically as long as my couch. On GameStop Rewards, this flag was worth 50,000 points to redeem it. That is one badass flag. And over here, this is like some type of fabric. This is more valuable. I actually won this from Assassin's Creed, the Twitter account. They actually sent me this pirate chest and it was filled with a lot of goodies. One of the goodies I actually won from the official Twitter account was this. This is a signed picture from Todd McFarlane. This is from San Diego Comic-Con 2013. I did not attend Comic-Con, but I was not going to say no to this. We have Connor. That's Connor's dad. And there's Kenway. Such a nice poster. I was not going to say no to that. So let's go ahead and close this chest. I already showed you this. And what do we have over here? Let me move the pirate chest over. Hello, Kenway. Kenway is holding a rope. There's a pirate flag in the back. He's holding his nice sword in the background. Twitter is blowing up. Hello, Twitter. Hey, look. What do you know? <gasps> Mentioned by Assassin's Creed. We think you might be right. Oh, that is funny. Wait a minute. I'm going to actually answer this. Holy shit. Hold on. Did Assassin's Creed the official Twitter account actually tweet me? Hold on, I gotta get this on camera. This is totally worth it. Yes, they tweeted me. Look, it's the official Assassin's Creed Twitter account. This is what I tweeted them. Look at this. I had said, has anyone ever heard of Assassin's Creed before? I heard it was kind of a big game and smiles. I actually took a picture of my collection of Assassin's Creed and then I tweeted them. And this is what they said to me. Trying to sort, you think you might be right. Dude, they actually fucking tweeted me. Hell yeah. I'm gonna retweet this on camera. I'm such a lucky bastard. I'm retweeting it through the camera lens. That is crazy. Let's go back to the statue. Sorry, my fan girling right now. So there's Kenway. Let's put him to the side. There's a Assassin's Creed limited edition box from two years ago. And here is the limited edition Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag box. This came in the treasure chest as well. It's also a Kenway action figure, which I'm never going to take out of the box. You're not supposed to take it out of the box. Look, I guess it's plus 8. I'm 20. Yeah, I might be over the age limit, but who the fuck cares? I love Assassin's Creed. There's a lot of characters you can collect. Look, there's Connor. There's Connor's dad. There's Blackbeard. I didn't know they had Blackbeard in here. It's really neat. Uh, so I think that's almost everything. Oh, wait, 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 wait a minute. I gotta show you these things. These are actual backpacks. I never even took the plastic off. I actually redeemed these on GameStop Reward. It's like 6,000 points. I have two of them. And I also have one of Kenway. Look, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. That is awesome. I also have the display box from GameStop. One of my very good friends, Felix, who has left the company, sadly, he gave me the display box for Assassin's Creed 3. This is actually one of the boxes they put in the window. This was like the best present ever. Ignite the American Revolution. I've had this box for years now, but back when PS3 and Xbox 360 were control of the console market, now it's Xbox One and PS4. And it's been a very long time since I played this game. Pre-order now and get the Lost Mayan Ruins mission and in-game Saw Two Sword. Dude, it's been a long time since they played Assassin's Creed. And then you have the Xbox One with that shitty Kinect in there. Dude, I never took that Kinect out. It's so fucking blocky. I'm never going to take it out of the box. I actually have a pirate hat. I'm not even kidding you. Look, it has a little feather on it. It's actually my Halloween costume. I can actually put it on. Uh, I might look ugly right now. I didn't really do my hair today. I'm a pirate. Ah! My hair is all fucked up. Look, I'm a pirate. I have a pirate hat. Yeah, I really gotta fix my hair. I didn't trade in it today. I'm a huge Assassin's Creed fan. One last thing I have to show you guys is this. On my beanie, I have the Assassin's Creed Unity E3 exclusive button. I saw this button going on eBay for 40 bucks. I'm not even kidding you. People were stripping E3 clean and selling every damn thing they could sell. Over here I have the magazines from E3. From day one, day two, and day three. People were selling the shit for like five bucks. It was crazy. So yeah, this is my huge collection of Assassin's Creed stuff I've collected over the years. It has been one hell of a collection, and I'm so grateful I have all this to show you guys. So right now, we're going to do the giveaway. I'm going to tell you how to win, and I'll, be, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Bye. I'm such an idiot. I forgot to include this in the video. I also have an Assassin's Creed 3 display poster from GameStop. And also, I have this. It's a map of Assassin's Creed 3, of the frontier and New York, and then there's Boston. This came in my strategy guide. I forgot to show this on camera. All right, now it's time for the giveaway. So, China Star, how are we supposed to win Assassin's Creed Unity on the PC? Well, I will tell you. Three simple rules. One, subscribe to me on YouTube. If you're already subbed to me, do not worry about this. Number two, follow me on Twitter. So if you actually do win this game, I will DM you via Twitter. 
I do not like the YouTube messaging system. I just hate it. I prefer Twitter. Twitter is more easy for me to use to get in contact with people. And number three, now this is what you're going to have to do in order to win this. Here is the question I have for everyone, new viewers and current viewers. Right now, I'm about to reach my two-year anniversary of the channel. I've been making videos for almost two years now. It's kind of crazy. And I know back in the day, my videos are really shitty, but I've noticed my quality and my experience, it's just what YouTube in general has really increased. I started my channel making Black Ops 2 montages and they were just god awful. But now we have reached a point where my video production is really good compared to how it used to be back in the day. My question to you, the viewer, is what in particular do you like about me, my personality, or the channel in general? I just want your feedback. Even if you don't want to enter this giveaway, I would love to hear what you guys think about some of the improvements I made over the years because I was a really bad YouTuber. I was a new, but now I wouldn't say I'm professional. I really hate gloating about myself. I'm just going to say this flat out. I am way better at making videos than I was back in the day, and that's just my honest opinion. I really am, but I want to hear back from you guys. Now, I know everyone's not going to comment on this video. The channel just broke over 400 subs. We're about 415 right now, but I just want to hear your honest opinion. What in particular? do you like about me my personality or the channel I just want to know even if you do not enter this giveaway if you don't have a great PC I understand but I would love to hear some feedback from you guys because I know not everyone comments on things so I don't know what you like what you don't like my Borderlands series is going on right now my Evolve series is going on right now I have a lot of series kind of getting overwhelmed right now in order for me to catch just my backlog I have to do like two or three videos a day for weeks because I am just swamped in videos I think I might have chewed a little bit more than I can handle the Assassin's Creed comes out no November 11th this contest ends November 9th the time is probably going to be 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time I 5 p.m. I will close the giveaway I will go through all the comments and I will pick a winner and then they're following me on Twitter which they should be I will DM them their code and then they have to redeem it on the Ubisoft website and the codes good for them but just keep in mind you need a GTX 680 graphics card to play this game my Twitter is blowing up right now, I'm sorry. If your PC specs do not match the requirements in the description down below, do not enter this giveaway. I don't mind if you give me a feedback. Do not do not tell me you want the game, but your PC can't handle it. You don't have enough horsepower. I'm sorry to say this, but I would hate to give away a game where you can't run it. It's kind of a waste of a video and kind of a game as well. This is just for the people who have the PC to run this game. So if you really want Assassin's Creed Unity for free, this is the contest for you to enter. And I promise, this is the full retail game. I have not used this yet. I may have used my other code but this is the code I have not used yet. Um, I actually pre-ordered Assassin's Creed Unity at GameStop for the PC, but I had to cancel my pre-order and change it to the shitty Xbox One because my graphics card could not run it. So now I can't even play Unity until a week after. And they told me they're all sold out. So I have to wait a week longer. So that means I won't get to play the game a week after Assassin's Creed Unity launches. I was going to do another unboxing video. I remember last year I did one for Assassin's Creed Black Flag. But that's going to be postponed. That is why I'm doing the giveaway a week early. This was not planned. I just found out I had to change my pre-orders. I'm kind of upset right now because in Black Flag, the minimum requirement is like a 270 or 300 series for NVIDIA. This requires a 680. That's a huge increase just for minimum requirements. They recommend it's like a 750. And the main reason why they want such a high graphics card is because they render all the AI. The big selling point for Assassin's Creed Unity was to render all those people on the screen. And you need a beefy graphics card. The PC side of Assassin's Creed Unity is trying to compete with next-gen consoles. No, really no reason to compete with them. But I got fucked over. I have a 660, not a 680. So like I said, if you guys want to win this game, Go in the comments down below, write your honest opinion on what you think about all the channel improvements I've been doing over the past year. I don't mind criticism or support, I will accept all feedback. There's probably a couple games you know, I've played over over the years that you have not liked. I, I don't mind getting criticism as long as it sounds nice, or I, I don't know. Just give me your honest opinion what you think about the channel. My second year anniversary is next month, so I'm really excited for that. Thank you guys for watching this very long video, I'm so sorry it was really long. And I'll see you guys later, have a great day. Make sure to enter my giveaway, and I'll see you guys Sunday. I will publicly announce the winner on Twitter this Sunday. All right. Please subscribe to the Pony Ever today and I'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Bye. I am an assassin. Goodbye, YouTube. For now.